2023 is drawing to a close, which means it's the perfect time to look back at some of the groundbreaking studies that involved animal research this year. As usual, you can find more detail on these stories on the UAR website and links are provided in the caption below. We started the year with a story from Harvard Medical School, where they were able to reverse the signs of aging in mice. Building on the work of biologist Shinya Yamanaka, a scientist who was awarded the 2012 Nobel Prize for the discovery of a protein cocktail capable of reprogramming adult cells into versatile stem cells. The Harvard researchers injected Yamanaka's protein cocktail into genetically modified aged mice, and they found that it reversed some of the signs of aging. A second study reported on in Science also used Yamanaka's protein cocktail to reverse aging in mice. Carried out by Rejuvenate Bio, researchers injected elderly mice with the proteins and observed an increased lifespan compared to control animals. On average, the mice injected with the protein cocktail lived for another 18 weeks, compared to nine weeks for the control group. In spring, Researchers from the University of Manchester and funded by the British Heart Foundation discovered a new structure inside the goat heart. The structures produce the electrical signals necessary to make the heart beat when the main electricity producing cells called the SA node fail. This natural pacemaker was identified in a study involving 15 goats. Goats were chosen because they have a similar anatomy and physiology to humans, as well as producing a similar heartbeat as we do, which gives researchers confidence that these results will be highly relevant to humans. In the summer months, it was reported that the first womb transplant to take place in the UK had been successful. The operation carried out at the Oxford University Hospital's Oxford Transplant Centre took over nine hours to perform and it was made possible thanks to the woman's sister who donated her womb. Since the early 2000s, scientists have been perfecting womb transplantation through animal research in order to increase our understanding of this complex organ. First experiments were carried out on rats and mice. Following on from this, womb transplantations were carried out on larger animals, sheep, pigs and rabbits. Most recently, monkeys have been used to perfect the surgery before moving into human trials. In autumn, scientists at Imperial College London and the Rosalind Institute created the world's first flu-resistant chickens through gene editing, marking a breakthrough in the fight against avian influenza. By altering the ANP32A gene in chickens, Researchers made the birds highly resistant to avian flu, with 9 out of 10 birds showing no signs of infection when exposed to the virus. However, the researchers cautioned that infections were not completely blocked, which has to be achieved before introducing gene-edited chickens to farms. Otherwise, there's a very high risk of the virus evolving to become more dangerous to humans. The results suggest that editing three genes rather than one is more likely to achieve total resistance. And finally, our top 3R story of 2023, looking at the approaches to replace, reduce and refine the number of animals used in scientific research. Our 3R story comes from the National Centre for the 3Rs, who awarded this year's 3Rs prize to Dr Lisa Waga for her entirely animal-free tonsil organoid which models respiratory infection and immunity. Using cells from human tissue samples, Dr. Waga developed miniature tonsils known as organoids. Organoids are an exciting field of research that are already helping to reduce the number of animals used in biomedical research. And that brings us to the end of our 2023 Animal Research News Roundup. For more information on the stories in this video, as well as tons of other exciting research breakthroughs from throughout the year, check out our website. And of course, don't forget to like and subscribe for more animal research videos.